Okay, I'm live, man. I'm waiting for everybody to get in. Yo, whatever. <laughs> Hi, my loves. Hi, my honey bunnies. What's everybody doing? As you can tell by the title or whatever, we're gonna be um, unboxing some BGA crew mail. So I'm just waiting for everyone to get here. I'm waiting for specifically Idolina and Canna's World. If you guys are in here, can you let me know? Hi, hi Kim. I'm good, how are you? Drinking out my coldest water bottle. I know, yes boo. I just got, look, I got the 64 ounce. My mom got the 32, uh, the 34 ounce. We are so happy, dude. These, these are the best. The absolute best. And it does what it says. I tested it out. And uh, 48 hours, it literally held my water cold, full of ice. Shout out to Jimmy Gay. Hey, what's up? Hi, where's Canna's World and Idolina? Are you guys here? I don't. Want, they sent me two bo a, a box each, so I don't want to start without them. I feel kind of bad. Canna's World and Idolina. I have Idolina doesn't have any other social media, so I don't even know how to get a hold of her. Um. Well, anyways, I, oh, Canna's World! Yay! Canna's in here! Yeah! 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 Uh huh! Yeah! A la beam. A la bon, a la bim bom ba. <laughs> yeah, so uh, anyway, I don't think Idolina's in here. Um, just got home. I don't know how to contact her, so I'm going to start with hers. I'm going to keep this video up anyway, so she can see it later. Hi, Taylor. Okay, so Idolina sent me and Diana a box. I kind of already opened it the other day. Um... So let's see. She sent us each Selena cups. Can you believe that? So this is number one. Selena cups. You know me and that well, Diane most. Most of all is a diehard Selena fan. I love Selena, period, you know. This is cup number two. I've been good, Mike. How are you? So, and then she sent uh, a double set, obviously one for me, one set for Diane. And I'm not going to read her, her letter just because I don't, I, I don't think she might want me to read it. It's kind of personal. Um, but I'll show you guys. She drew some artwork. So she did write us a three-page letter. Her handwriting is immaculate. So she says, I will read this. This is a little side note. It says, Diane, I know I didn't get the cup you wanted. I am sorry. Nay, I know you didn't ask for anything, but I can't forget about you. Aw, that is so sweet. But look at, she uh, wrote, she drew each one of us a little picture, and I'm about to get to that. So for me, she drew, of course, the Hello Kitty, and it says, Big Guy Appetite. Hi, my baby Casey. Look at how cute, you guys. She drew that all by herself. Look at how talented she is. Jonathan Perez, como esta? Saludos. And then she drew this for Diane. She says, future wife, boo thing, my love. Look at how talented this girl is. That is so adorable. So yeah, she drew that for Diane and the Hello Kitty for me. <clears throat> All right, so moving on. This is gonna be just a little short video, you guys. I just wanted to come on here and, and share these with you, open up the uh, BGA mail with you. So moving on, this one is from Canna, Canna's World. So let's, I'm excited. I had no idea, no idea that Canna had even sent anything until 
he hinted. I know. I now I look back and I realize he was hinting. He had said, "Check your mail name a couple week or like a week ago, or something like that." And I thought he was just joking. And then fast forward to a couple days ago, he's like, "Hey Nate, have you checked your PO box?" And I'm like, "Uh, not yet. Why?" He's like, "Oh, just check it by Wednesday." I'm like, "Okay." So I had absolutely no idea whatsoever that he had sent anything. Okay. And I covered their both of their addresses. Oh my God! <laughs> Oh my God, I've been wanting to try these. Mom. Oh, and he sent the huge packs. Oh my God, I swear. How many times did I tell you I wanted to try the four times, but they didn't have the purple bag here. And then I wanted to, I told um, uh, lovely, A I know I'm gonna show them right now. Lovely ASMR, I think that's her name. Love ASMR, oh my God, she's gonna murder me um, for getting it incorrect. But she was eating the pink bag and Angelina Spicy too. And I, oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh my God, Kenna. Okay, so he wrote a little, uh, I don't know if it's a letter or a card. So he, oh, whoop, I'm dropping stuff. Sorry guys. <laughs> you have got to be kidding me. Oh my God, these are freaking lovely. So the card is gorgeous. It says, thank you. Oh my God, I can't wait to show you guys these. Wow, this is so cute. So it says, <clears throat> I hope, Ken, is it, is it okay if I read this? Yeah, I'm pretty sure because it doesn't say anything like private. Uh, Dear Nate, just wanted to send you a small packet with some interesting noodles we found and hope you like. Thank you for always being so entertaining and supportive to all YouTube creators. We wish you success in this YouTube road. Oh, whatever. Laughing out loud, sincerely. P.S. Enjoy these stickers. Oh my God, you guys. Canna, that is so sweet. Look at these stickers. Me muero. Me muero. Me estoy muriendo. Look at these stickers. Un cotel. Ah! <laughs> He knows this is my favorite Mexican food. Mexican mariscos, un cocktail, okay? Oh my God. Una concha. Pop that concha, mommy, yeah. Yeah, pop that concha, mommy, oh. Yeah, pop, 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 pop. Una concha. Oh my God, these are amazing. Oh, oh my God. Un elote. Oh. <laughs> I love it. Kenna, you made me it's not I know. Un elote. Anybody want a Mexican elote? Ow! Oh! I'm so excited. This is the best ever. Oh my god, look at the last one. Oh my god, me muero. Me estoy muriendo. Taquitos de carne asada. Oh my god, these are the best. How do you even find stickers like this? Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. This is, oh my God, Canna. You outdid yourself, bro. Canna, where, where did you get these? Oh my God. Those stickers are amazing. Okay, let's move on. I know you guys can probably see already from here, but I don't know what these are. I want one of those. Yeah, of course, I'm going to share with you. Oh, uh, Nate is so happy to play. I know! Kenna, you really made my night. I'm so blessed with all of you guys. Even Idolina. Oh my God, all of you. So these are me goring fried noodles. Instant noodles. Ooh. Oh. These look delish. I swear, all three of these, these right here, I, I've never heard of these, uh, the first ones, but the curry spicy noodles. Oh, I got, I got to make some... Um, some uh, ramen noodles mukbang. The four times, well, I don't know if these are really four times. The mala, everyone says the malas are the four times hot. I don't know. 
Oh my God, I'm sim I'm smiling from ear to ear. Aw, Jessica. I freaking love you. Aw, oh, hi, Marisela. So yeah, I'm so excited to look at the purple bag. And then I saw the curry. I have been wanting to try so bad. But this one right here, the cheat, the spicy cheese noodles, mom. Oh, wow. Hot chicken uh, flavor ramen with cheese flavor. Ooh. So there's cheese up there. Oh. You guys, I have, I cannot find this pink bag, the purple bag, or the gold bag anywhere here in Arizona. And I go to my favorite Asian markets. The only ones they have are the Times 2 and the Black. One time I seen they had individual packages of the purple ones. But after that, I didn't buy them that day. But after that, when I went back, I no longer saw them ever again. Canna, you really outdid yourself. I don't know if you've if you wrote anything or commented. I'm sorry, because I'm so excited. I I didn't even read the the comments. But oh my god, Canna, if you're if you're still here watching, I you just wow. You made my night. Everybody, please, uh, Canna's World is a mukbang channel. He does food reviews uh, sometimes, and he does do lives. Him and his, uh, I don't know if, if Letty is his wife or his girlfriend. I should probably know that's rude of me, but um, we'll just say his partner. His partner, Letty, um, they sometimes go on live and they do like reviews. They try chocolates from their travels. They try uh, uh, certain foods. Um, so yeah, they're a, a mukbang channel. Thank you, everyone. You guys, please go add Canna's World. He just commented right here, Canna's World. Um, so if you guys can please go show him some love. He is a great guy. His wife is, um, I, I think she's from El DF in Mexico, so she does speak Spanish. To those of you who would like to conversate with her or say hello in Spanish, she does read and write Spanish, obviously. She's um, she's Mexican nationality. So, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm, I'm like on cloud nine right now. I have been wanting these noodles so bad. I, I literally, I literally, I think I want to try all three of them in like an, a mukbang. Yeah. Like all three, literally. Okay, yeah. Oh, my God. My mouth is salivating. <laughs> and I always watch Angelina Spicy um eat the pink bag and i've always been like damn i want the pink bag i just don't know how to get it what noodles are they they're the sam yang the sam yang brand um let me open it again so they're the sam yang brand this is the chicken flavor with cheese so it's mm. uh, technically cheese flavor they're, they're all hot they're the spicy noodles very hot um they're like the times one so they're not very hot, but they're spicy. Like, it'll, you'll have to eat an antacid before you eat these. Yes, you guys, please sub to Canna. Who said that? Was that my baby Casey? Yes. You guys, please sub to Canna. He's a great guy. Like I said, he sent me this box. He, he, that, that shows a lot about someone's character. You know what I mean? Um, like, to send someone, like, randomly a surprise, a surprise box, like, he has a big heart. So please, you guys add him. Um, like I said, he's another mukbang channel, so please sh support each other. So Sam Yang, these are the pink, the cheese noodles. But these ones right here, I'm like, oh my God. Who was eating these? I Was it Dal Darlin Pearls? I don't remember if it was my Darlin, Elijah. Somebody was eating the curry ones not too long ago, like maybe no more than a month ago. And I commented and I was like, oh my God, how do I get the brown, the uh, the gold bag? Oh my God, who was it? I don't remember. But anyway, these are the curry. Or was it Angelina? Me, I don't know. Doesn't matter. But anyway, yeah, the curry flavor, I'm dying for these. I love curry, you guys. I love it. And then these are the mala. The mala. Everybody says that the mala are four times hotter than than uh, all of them, the original. But um, I have no idea if that's true or not. I've heard mixed reviews. Some people said yes, some people said heck no, and they're nasty. But, that I mean, that's just what I've heard. Some people say they love them, they're the best flavors. Other people say they're, they're not that great. 
Um, but you guys, can you guys like this live? Please show me some love. I There's 90 people in here and I only see 26 likes. Can you show Big Papa, Big Shakeshi some, some love? I want you guys to smash that like button so hard that it slaps me in the face. Push! <laughs> I'm so much drama, I swear. I liked... Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. Hi, Heather. 27 now. Okay, it looks like I'm coming into some conversations. Hey, Baka boy. You're an, you are amazing, Nate. No, Kenna, you are amazing. Thank you. <clears throat> An egg? Oh, Dion, yes. It's so funny because before any of these came out, back in the day, my cousins used to crack open an egg into their, uh, we, we call it sopitas. Um, they used to crack open an egg into their sopita and let it like hard boil, I guess. And then, uh, uh, and it was like a top ramen. And I used to be like, oh my God, that's so weird. But now like, you've been slapped. <laughs> Jessica, slapped you for... Real hard, Nate. Yes, thank you. Ah! <laughs> Nate, can I see Adolina's gifts? I came in like, yeah, of course. So Adolina's gifts, for those of you that came late, she sent me and Diane multiples, so I'm just, I'm gonna show them. Selena cups. So these have like, obviously like a little snap lid, and it says Selena forever. So Selena. Selena, forever. Look at how cute, you guys. <clears throat> and then she sent this one. It says, Queen of Cumbia, Selena. So let me start from the front. Queen of Cumbia, Selena. And again, the little snap lid. That's so cool. And she put a little note in here. Diane, I know this is... I, I know I didn't get the cup that you wanted. I'm sorry. Nate, I know you didn't ask for anything, but I can't forget about you. And then, like I said, she wrote a three-page letter, which was so endearing, so loving. Um, but for her own privacy, since she's not here and didn't give me permission to read it, I'm not going to read it. <clears throat> but she did draw some little characters for us. Much love to Brazil. Obrigado. Brazil, mucho amor. I love the drawings. I know they're so cute. So for me, she drew a Hello Kitty and she said, Big Daddy Nate. <laughs> Big Daddy Nate. Oh my God, I gotta tell you guys a story about, now that I just remembered. You guys, I have to, I should have said it before. All right, let me show you this and I'm gonna tell you what happened when I picked these packages up at the, at the uh, post office. What are you going to do another unboxing video? Uh, when I get some more, some more mail, uh, I just got these, I got this one last week and I got this other one today. So as soon as I get some more mail, uh, I try to accumulate it a little bit and then do another unboxing. <clears throat> like three days ago when I fell in love with you, I watched 17 videos already. Your personality is really beautiful and you're funny. Love your mukbang. Oh, thank you, Gigi love. Mwah, thank you so much, honey bunny. So this is what she wrote, uh, what she drew for Diane. It says, future wife, boo thing, my love. Look at Casey. Isn't that so pretty? Wow, Idolina really, really like outdid herself with the drawings. Oh, so let me tell you the story. What happened when I picked this up? You guys, you will not believe my embarrassment. Ah, oh, Idolina, I'm gonna, I'm, I have some words to share with you, girl. How dare you? <laughs> I'm just kidding. So, I go to my, my P.O. box, and there's a card in there. Obviously, when I get a package that's bigger than my box, they put a little card in there where I have to go up to the front, give them the little slip, give them the little slip, and then they go in the back where they hold the boxes and, um, and retrieve it. So, they have never called out the title on my on my boxes before. They have never said like, big guy appetite, big guy appetite. They just come right to the counter where I'm waiting and they hand it to me. 
Well, this time, he probably read the name that she wrote and died laughing and said, wait, I have to say this out loud. So he comes as I'm waiting at the counter and he says, <clears throat> Un unplug. Oh, charge. Phone's at 2% so now. Oh my God, Persian King. Plug, charge your phone. So anyway, so I'm standing at the counter. He comes and in a loud, mind you, he's like 6'2", six, 6'3", six, tall guy <clears throat> with a big, like, burly voice. And he's like, Big Daddy Nate? Do we got a Big Daddy Nate and the future wife? And I'm like, oh my God. The post office was packed with people, like shoulder to shoulder. And he yells out, she wrote on here, Big Daddy Nate. I was so, I'm like, oh my God, tierra, tragame, swallow me earth, like hide me, mother earth, swallow me whole. And, uh, and everybody, you could just hear everybody in there like start laughing and giggling. And I felt the need to explain myself. I was like, yeah, my friend's trying to be funny. Uh, my name, my channel name is Big Guy Appetite, but she called me Big Daddy Nate for Q. I I was like, I didn't know what to say. I was like, oh my God, people are going to think I'm like a porn business or something. I don't know. Like I'm into like some crazy crap. So I was embarrassed. I was like, oh my God, Idolina, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> oh my God, I'm dead. Big Daddy Nate in the house. Oh, I was so embarrassed, you guys. Ah, oh, Persian. Can you say Paulie? Hi, Paulie. Oh, hi, Big Daddy Nate. That Persian king. Hi, my owl. My oh, how are you, my love? Yeah, Big Daddy Nate. God! No. <laughs> Ayolina, when I see you, girl, I'm gonna darte unas nalgadas, a little spanking. Yeah, is it too late now to say sorry? Because I'm missing yeah. more. Oh, the lyric. I love. Is it too late now to say sorry? Yeah. Cause I'm missing more than just your body. Oh, I love that song. <clears throat> Canna topped my box, bah. All of you guys, all of your guys' boxes are amazing. Nobody tops anyone. <clears throat> Canna is going to send another box with that name. <laughs> Please don't. Please don't, you guys. Oh my God. The only reason why I think they put it in my box or held it for me because the post office is very strict on what on names and obviously my my name at the post office is um, Big Guy Appetite or Nathan. So they know whenever I get a package with Nathan or Big Guy Appetite to hold it. But I think they held it because obviously it had the word big in it and then it had Nate. So... <clears throat> I hunk, I hunk a big daddy is the new name. <laughs> oh my God, Irina Joe. What happened to me when I got a package from Nasty Boy Click and B-Riders? He said about Nasty Boy Records. <laughs> oh, I love Nasty Boy Click. I will die for you, baby. I love Nasty Boy Click and then B-Riders. Big Daddy Nate. <laughs> oh my God. <clears throat> That's it, I'm putting myself in a box. Yes, Jessica. <laughs> Nate, when I get out the hospital, I'm going to send you your gift box with the English snacks and malt vinegar, fish and chips. So I'd, oh yes, I remember you mentioned that. With proper beans for beans and toast. Wow, how cool. Those are my favorite vinegar chips. I know. Well, no, 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 no. A malt vinegar oh. for that you put on top of fish and chips. It's a vinegar. Oh. It's a certain vinegar you put on like uh, French fries and oh, fried right. fish. <clears throat> Nate, you have a beautiful voice. Aw, thank you. Thank you, baby. Hi, Nate, how are you? Kicking it with Cheryl. Yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
How are you, my love? I'm good. I love when Cheryl does that. If you guys haven't seen uh, Kicking It With Cheryl, she is hilarious, you guys. You guys will fall in love with her. She has such a sweet, like, aura about her. She's so, she's such a sweet person. And uh, she does mukbangs with her husband. But not only that, she actually does recipes. For those of you that are always, like, asking me for recipes, you guys should really check her out because she actually does step-by-step -step, uh, recipes. And then she eat, her and her husband eat the food on camera. So... Yeah, that, that's another channel you guys might want to go check out. And her little catchphrase is, yeah, baby, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's so cute. I always do that, literally. I'm not even on YouTube, like, during the day. Like, I'll just be randomly throughout the house. And I'll just randomly, out of nowhere, just be like, yeah, baby, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mom's like, what are you doing? <laughs> Thank you guys for the, showing them love. You guys, you guys are amazing. Oh, listen to this, Mom. You were just talking about this. Uh -huh. They said, Nate, make a gumbo mukbang one day. It's my favorite food at the moment. Love you. Enjoy. Hilarious. Thank you, Monica King. Gumbo? My mom has been talking about gumbo. So, I don't know how to make it. Hopefully, she does. You know how to make it, Mom? No? Jambalaya. I know how to oh, jambalaya. Why was I thinking gumbo and jambalaya were the same thing? <laughs> Sorry. I confused jambalaya with gumbo. Yeah. <clears throat> Good night. Oh, my Lily Pop. She's going to bed. Good night, Lily Pop. What are you getting into tonight, Big's Daddy? <laughs> Nothing. I gotta I gotta film a mukbang. I'm doing a collab with someone special for tomorrow. I'm posting it tomorrow, you guys. And it's gonna be so much fun. We're actually doing uh, I'm not telling you what we're doing, but it's going to be up tomorrow evening, and it's a very special collab. I love this person so much. She's like she's like a second mom to me. She literally, we talk outside of YouTube. We became friends, so she's such a lovely woman. Thank you, Lindy. Okay, you guys. Okay, there we go. I need to plan an AZ trip. Yes, that would be fun. Oh, my God. Excuse my dog. Hold on. Tiger, enough. Okay. Idolina, my boo, you're finally here. You're finally here. You're finally here. Yeah. I opened your box already, my love. I opened your box. I'm going to keep this video up. If you guys that are just joining, if you guys want to watch, you guys can always rewind this live to the front or to the beginning. Hi, Kim. So, yes, like I was saying, um, what I'm going to get into, I'm going to do a, a mukbang tonight. It's a collab. And like I said, this person, she's, so, she's such a sweetheart. Me and her have actually gotten close outside of YouTube. Like, she, we don't live in the same state, but we have each other's personal cell phone numbers and we talk. So, just know that this collab is, is coming from a place where we actually know a little bit about each other's personal lives. And we actually genuinely love each... What? Hold on, I just got a, a cash app. 50... Oh my God! Oh my God, someone... Uh, someone sent me a $50 on my cash app. Oh. They want to they wanna keep it anonymous. They said, shh. So, oh my God, I want to thank you. I want to say your name, but... You said, thank you. Thank, thank you so you. much. Thank you. It says, because I love you. Hold on, let me pull it back down. Oh, that is so sweet. Aww. Thank you, my love. No, no, because I'm going to, I'm going to do that mukbang. Wow, that was so sweet. I know. Thank you. So, um, so yeah, I want you guys to really like this mukbang or this collab. 
um, is an important, all, all of my collabs are important, but this one, like, we, she needs our support, you know, and I want BGA crew to, like, really come through and, and add, you know what I mean? Add her, subscribe, so, Nate, is that the special collab? Yes, for tomorrow. I love all of my collabs. Don't get me wrong. I love all of my collabs. But um, support the collabs. They're always great people. Yes, yes, yes. All, support all collabs. I guess, but what I'm trying to say is this one is special because I've never, I've never collabed with her before. A lot of my collabs have been multiples. A lot of them. I do like repetitive collabs with them. Um, but this one is the first time. And um, second of all, like I said, she has grown to be like um, a second mother. Like she is so nurturing and um, she always gives me advice. She has my back. Like when, when people like piss me off or, or come, come for me, she immediately starts texting me like, oh my God, do you want me to go off? Let me know. You're like my son. I'm going to defend you. I'm like, no, 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 no need for that. Like. We have each other's back, is all I'm saying. Like, she means a lot to me. So, tomorrow, I want you guys, the minute that I do that collab, hit that subscribe button on her channel. Show her some love, and let's show her what BGA crew can do. Like, you know what I mean? Hi, my love. Hi, Crystal. Saludos desde Ciudad Juarez. Cuídate, gracias, Raúl. Te mando un saludote hasta Ciudad Juarez. We got your back, Nate. Thank you, Kenna. See, my close, like, Kenna, like, my close among uh, other creators and supporters, like, you guys probably already have her added, but I'm mostly saying this to, like, the new people that are watching me, because I'm pretty sure. Darling! Hey, what's up? Marvelous. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure a lot of you that are, like, that are in our little circle um, have her already added. Um, but I'm just, I'm speaking to the general, like, viewers that are watching right now who don't have her. Please support her, you guys. She's such, like, her setup, like, she, you could tell she puts so much time, energy, and effort into her stuff. And, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited. Sherman, 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 Sherman. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um... And mind you, I've only nibbled a, like, on, a, on a couple snacks the whole freaking day just to do this collab. Just to do this collab because I'm like, yeah. Greta Aguirre, love your name. Oh, there's two Gretas up in here. Up in here. How many Gretas up in here? Up in here. <laughs> sticker on the bottle. What? Oh, put my stickers on my bottle. I know, but I wash this, so I don't want my stickers to ruin. Like, come off. No, I wanna. I wanna save my my stickers forever and ever and ever. I don't think I wanna unstick them. You're such a nice man. Plus, and inscribed. I love the way. Man, could you be my father? <laughs> Aw, that was sweet. Thank you. <laughs> hey, I love your channel so much. Oh, whatever. Thank you, Tanya. Thank you, my love. Can you give a shout out to Chicago in the house, Denise? Yes, yeah, shout out to Chicago, the Windy City, or oh, whatever. Yes, where my Crystal Marie at, though? I seen her a little bit ago, and I got distracted. I'm sorry. Where my Crystal girl? Nate, does the bottle have an insert to put in, in the freezer? No, it doesn't. Nope. It's just, it's insulated. It says right here, insulated. So literally, it keeps your ice for like 48 hours. Uh, like whole, intact. 
I need to buy my coldest water bottle still. I know. Literally, me and my mom ordered ours. My mom got, where's your pink one? Huh? Where's your pink water bottle? So I can show them. Kenna said the stickers are water. Oh, they're waterproof. Oh my God. I would love to put them on my, oh my God, yes. I'm gonna put them on here. But I wanna wash this with soap to remove any oils. Cause you know, your my hands are greasy, oily, whatever. And uh, that way they'll have like some grit to stick. Why do I feel like I just said bricks to sticks? <laughs> grip to stick. What's your favorite color? My favorite color is uh, teal. Like turquoise or teal with between those two colors. Mostly teal though. More like more to the teal side. Waterproof. Okay, gotcha. Hit that like button, y'all. Yes, you guys smash that like button. Oh, so this is my mom. She got the smaller one. This I got the 64 ounce. And then my mom got the uh 30 32 ounce. So And they come with the straw. Well, it depends on which one you order because if you, and then it has like the little spout. When you put it down, it's like an airtight seal. Nothing can come in or out of this. Um, but yeah, this is the pink one. If they have an option where it's just like a twist cap, but there's no straw and you can drink out of it like that. Or uh, you can get the, I think it's like a couple bucks more, like two, three dollars more. You get the one with uh, the straw. Oh, your mom is, your mom's one is cute. Yeah, I love it. It's so pretty. It's called Flamingo Pink or something like that. There's a smaller one than those. It is so, yes. So they have two, two sizes uh, smaller. They have a 21 ounce. Can I see the 21 ounce? So they have the 21 ounce and they have it in pink. And, um, and then they have a smaller one than this one. This is the twist cap I was telling you about. You can twist this off and then drink like that. So they're completely insulated. And yeah, the ice keeps cold for days. Uh, but there's an even smaller one for kids. And it's like a 12 ounce. It's so adorable, you guys. So cute. But uh, the next one that I want to purchase is the gallon. It's like this big and it's a one gallon. That's the one I want. I'm getting the black and a pink one. Yes, Casey. You won't be disappointed, you guys. I love mine. They can take a beating. Yes, that's what I heard. I, I, I've been cherishing mine like it's a little newborn baby. Like, I'm cautious when I set it down. I'm like, oh, my love. Careful, careful with my baby. Um, but yeah. My Brittany's going to bed. Good night, my Brittany. Shh. Chachi. Hush. So yeah, um, I don't know. I love them. In the beginning, I was like, what's all the hype? Like, it's just a water bottle. But their motto is, this is... You only need one bo water bottle for the rest of your life. And basically, this is it. Like, this is... And it comes with a life, lifetime warranty. So if there's any manufacturer defects or anything, you hit them up, they send you a new one. I'm broke for that, just saying. But I do drink so much water, though. Especially because I'm getting hot. It's getting hotter. Yeah. Yeah. It's important to have a water bottle for the summer. This summer, I'm gonna be filling mine up with micheladas or whatever by the pool. Yeah, don't judge me, don't come for me. It's gonna be full of michelada by the pool. Extra lime juice. Oh my God, why did my mouth just salivate so bad? Uh, I, haven't had, I haven't had a drink in a couple weeks now. So I've been, I've been sober and I love it. I love it, I love it. So maybe I'll have some in, a, in, in due time. I just wanted to take a little break from drinking. You would, Nate. Like, <laughs> what I do, so uh, Lupita, what I do? Say what, Lifetime? Um, say what, Lifetime? Um, yes, sir. <laughs> uh, yes, auntie. Uh, 
I know where you live. Good. Stop on by. Stop on by. Come along. Hop a carpet and fly to another Arabian night. Arabian night. Like Arabian days. Come on through. If you know where I live or whatever. Uh, anywho, anywho, to the who, to the two. Wow, good for you. Thank you, my owl. Micheladas in three weeks, compa. Yes, Rob D. Rob to the D. To the D. To the D. Yes, Rob, I can't wait for you to come down here, bro. I cannot wait. I have been craving that piña con chile, michelada, and crystal was. Oh, yes. I haven't seen the piña one here, but we definitely have the mango now. You're so cute, mijo. Oh, thank you, my Cynthia. <clears throat> oh, my goodness. You need to sing more often. Oh, thank you, my Heather. What are you eating in your next collab mug thing? I can't say. It's a surprise. It's a surprise. <laughs> Camarones a la diabla y micheladas. Hell yeah, bro. Carrie, I need to move to AZ. Yes, Carrie. If I know and had means to make it, hauls definitely come through. Yes. Your skin looks beautiful. Oh, thank you. But literally, I'm like, I wore um, some foundation the other day. And I literally broke out on my chin. I got three pimples. One, two, three. Bleh. I miss easy weather. It's hot as hell. Mm. You guys, I still never had chile rellenos. I still have not had them. You look better without foundation. I do. You got, You think so? I don't know. I'm just kind of, I'm a little insecure with my freckles. That's why I wear, that's the whole reason why I wear um, foundation, just because I'm very insecure about it. I freaking love you. Love your personality. I need a video on how you get your brow snatched. Oh my God, so a lot of people, you guys have been asking me for a, a get ready with me, but I don't know. I told them that I'm kind of scared because I don't want to like, to like deter people off my channel with like a get ready with me mukbang, like doing my, my facial, my eyebrows or whatever, you know, I'm, I'm kind of scared because I'm like, I don't want people to like unsubscribe because they don't like that, you know? They subscribe to me because I, I'm a mukbang channel. So I don't know. Go on, natural. Your skin will love you and you're gorgeous. Oh, uh, thank you, Justina. Yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying to, to be a little more um, confident with that. Yes, better without makeup. The freckles or beauty marks flaunt that. Oh, thank you, guys. I saw your cut crease video and loved it. Thank you, Lupita. See, I posted that a long time ago when I only had like probably five or six hundred subscribers so i was like okay with it at the time but now with you know where i'm at now i'm kind of like i don't know i don't know i just picture me putting it up and then like a whole bunch of like unsubscribes get ready live oh a live version i think i would be okay with a live version oh my god no <laughs> Nate, no matter what you tape or do on your channel, we will support you. Thank you, Carrie. <laughs> Ashley, topless mukbang is still my number one vlog. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, you do whatever you think is fun to do. Oh, thank you. I think I'm gonna, what is he whining about? Shush! Because he sees our money out here. That's why. Hi. What Carrie said. Thank you, Persian. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys so much for supporting me. You guys are amazing. You make me smile. Aw. Thank you, guys. Do it on the tips. Oh, yeah. I could do it on the tips. Yeah. That's not a bad idea. Who said that? Was that Monica? Yeah, Monica Seals. Yeah, that's a good idea, Monica. What Read what Persian said. Oh, shoot. Did I miss what he said? Hold on. Monica. 
my dog, and Molly. It's currently charging. I don't see any, uh, I love surprises. No, I don't see any more from him. And then I see that where he agreed with Carrie. Oh, he said, I support whatever you do, bro. You've always supported me since day one. I appreciate everything you do. Ah, oh, thank you, Purge. Purge, like I said, bro. Brothers for life, bro. Was glad to get your notification on live. Calling it a night. Looking forward to your video tomorrow. Oh, thank you, Heather. Hi, DG. How are you, sweetie pie? I love your number. What? Oh, I'll have two number nines. A number nine large. A, <laughs> a number six or extra dip. <laughs> number seven. <laughs> two number 45s. One with cheese and a lot of <laughs> Oh, my God. That sounds like what I used to do. I used to be like... I used to tell Diane, Tiff, I so want to call the pizza place and be like, hi, excuse me. Hold on. Dang, these dogs are losing their minds. I, I used to tell Diane, I want to um, call the pizza place and be like, excuse me. Can I get a large pizza, no cheese, no marinara sauce, and no toppings? And then uh, I need gluten-free, so no crust. Okay, so you want an empty box. No, I want an extra large cheese pizza, no cheese, no pizza, no sauce. <laughs> uh, so essentially, you want no pizza, sir? <laughs> Uh, I never did it, though, but I always fantasized about calling them and see what they would say. <laughs> Thank you, Ma'al. I adore Nate. He's such a great person. Oh, what did my Ma'al say? Oh, that Persian king so sweet. You're mess. Yes, Ma'al. Persian king is such a good man. Such a good man. <clears throat> Indian food. I know they closed our favorite Indian food place. I'm trying to find a good one. Yes, Persian is a diehard Nate supporter. We had this heartfelt convo and he spoke of Nate so highly. It was cute. Nate has brought so many friendships. Oh, Lupita. Wow. That really makes my day. I know. I'm like literally shocked at how many people we have, have come together on this channel because of this platform, like not just me, I mean YouTube in general, this platform that I have been given, like so many of us have come together. I would have never met everyone that I know, like What the Mukbang, uh, Mama D, uh, Bittersweet Rose and Miguel, Lottie. I would have never, never, Lindy B, Baby Casey, Persian, all of you guys. Nate, you're not drinking? No, DG. This is um, pomegranate lemonade from QT. I love, love their pomegranate lemonade and it's uh, light. So it's like five calories per serving or something like that. But, <clears throat> but yeah, no, I had made a promise that I wasn't gonna drink for a couple weeks, you know, just to kind of refresh, regroup and all that. And I haven't, I haven't had not a sip of anything. So I'm doing good. I I'll eventually, I think I'm gonna drink again when um, Rob D comes down here. Because um, he's coming down here to visit LJ and a couple other friends. And, of course, me, you know, we're, we're, we're going to get together. So, obviously, we're going to drink and chill. Hey, boo, just went back on the video. I didn't know they yell your name outside. <laughs> no, they don't yell your name out, my love. He did it on purpose. He wanted to purposely embarrass me. <laughs> and I'm standing there like in literally like my house slippers, some shorts, a like little crusty t-shirt and my hat. Like I was literally just my comfortable self. And when they said big daddy, big daddy Nate, I'm like, they're probably thinking some big muscular sexy daddy. And it's some big fat dude wearing house clothes and slippers. <laughs> I have no shame. I go I go to the post office and my slippers bad. It's only when I like go out to eat or like somewhere nice that I obviously dress up. 
But if I'm comfortable, bad, you're going to see me with my ugly eyebrows and my house closed. Nate, do you like pineapple pizza? That is, that is something that... Armani! Hush! Jesus! My dogs are on one... Mom, what is, what is triggering them? What is going on? They're never like this. Something is triggering them. I think you need to close all their, their cages because they're getting jealous that one's out. Yeah, I did. Uh, pineapple pizza? Yes, I love pineapple pizza with ham. I never had it growing up, but Di I think it's Diane who loves it. I think Diane is the one who orders it, and I'm the one who, who tried it. That's my favorite. Oh, that's your favorite, Ma? But yes, yes. To answer your question, yes, I do. I love it. Thank you, Adelina. I'm finishing the... Recording process on Saturday. I haven't had a chance to finish it, but me and my engineer are finally finishing this. Oh, Persian, I can't wait. If you guys have not heard Persian's music, I feels meal. Somebody post, um, if, if one of my mods could please post, or Persian, if you want to post your own link in here to your my favorite song that you, that you uh, created, please post it. People, you got to get on this song. This song is so real. The lyrics, oh my God. He talks about like his anxiety and and issues. Like, oh my God, like real life issues. Dude, I related so much to this, this song. The dogs are mad. You're not talking to them, paying attention to the fur food. <laughs> I know, Carrie. They're little brats. Oh my God, I love them to death, but Jesus. They can, they are wild. Baby has me in tears today. Big sexy, I meant it, autocorrect. A bitch for some reason. <laughs> Aw. My Anna. Hi, my Anna P. Hell yeah, Team Pineapple Pizza. I know. I don't, a lot of people don't like it. I, I'm not a big fan of meat on my pizza. Howard, yes, I did. It's deactivated. What happened? I love your videos at the Chinese Buffet. Oh, thank you, Bethy. Bethy too. Thank you. You're welcome, bro. You're welcome, Purge. Nate, why do you keep on deleting your live videos? You tease us and then make us wait and wait and wait. I'm sorry, 2D. So what happens is the reason why I delete my my lives um, when I'm out in public is because people will tell me like, hey, oh my God, I just heard Shania Twain in the background or I just heard Ariana Grande's music in the background. And so I'm scared that if I let it post... YouTube is going to give me a copyright strike. Thank you. Thank you, darling. Thank you for posting that. Yes, you guys, go check out Persian's music. Man, especially that one song. That that one song is mad fire. I'm honored that you love my music, bro. If nobody else listened to it, I'm glad you like it. Aw, oh, thank you, bro. But yes, uh, 2D, to answer your question, um, sometimes these restaurants that I go to, they play loud music. And I'm scared that I'm going to get a copyright strike if I leave the live up. Just because once you leave the live up, YouTube does like the YouTube automated like bots. They detect the music and they'll give me a copyright strike. So during is okay a little bit. Um, but posting is a big no-no. So that's the reason why I have to delete them. The ones that you do see me post up and leave up, it's because the music is not very uh, prominent. So I'm okay with leaving those ones up. But I am very sorry you guys feel like I'm teasing you and and not, um, you know, and doing it purpose. Well, I am doing it purposely, but maliciously. <clears throat> yes, The Breakdown. The Breakdown. Yes, that's the name of the song, you guys. I love other songs as well, but this one is my favorite. Where my baby Casey? My baby Casey, I miss her. I haven't seen her in my lives often. I mean, I'm not not often, but I mean like recently. How's my baby Casey? I'm here. Oh, my Casey and my Landers. Hi, Mrs. B. How are you? For those of you uh, that don't remember. Um, I think she, she said it the last time she was here. Mrs. B, you guys know Mrs. B, Miss Bob Seda. 
What up, Kitty Pie? Hi. Meto Tisi. Hola. How are you? Hi, Lauren. Galvin. Casey's my bestie. I know. You and Casey. <clears throat> a Persian king. I have to leave the live and take Manny his store keys. I don't want to go, girl. Oh, my Anna. You should tell Manny, Manny, don't be forgetting your keys next time because you interrupting my lives. <laughs> oh. Persian, I do poems, a letter, and you inspire me to do one of anxiety and depression, and my family love it. I would show you, but it would have to be on my mom, my mom's IG, because I don't got no social media. Wow. I used to do poetry, too. I actually, yeah, I, I that poetry to me was like an, an um, a release. Is that what it is for you, Idolina? Like, when you write your poetry, does it like help you soothe, like ease your anxiety? Cause that's what it used to do to me. I don't write anymore, but it used to really help me a lot. I'm good. I keep missing your lives, but I made it now. Booyah. Yes, baby. Yes. See, now I sound like Cheryl. Yeah, baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I love to see it. I, I'd love to see it, Adelina. Yes, Adolina, you should share it too. I want to see it. Nate, what other things do you like to eat that you can't get out there? Hint, hint. Aw, Jessica, you're such a sweetheart. Um, I don't really know what they have on the East Coast. That's the thing. Like, I'm just, I've been so familiarized with everything on the West Coast that I don't even know what what is out there for, like, you know, that I haven't tried or, or not able to get out here. Thank you, bro. I, I love it when you come in here, bro. Like, you make my day. All of you guys make my day. But I, I especially love when I see, like, my my true peeps, you know, come in here and, and support. So I love it. Not sure if you got my last message. Oh, it's to Courtney. At Nate, I love you and your personality, and you're such an amazing man. Oh, my Carrie Boo Boo. Yes, Boo, it helps me so much, especially when times get hard and I have no one to talk to, but no more because I got my BGA crew and God has blessed me with a family that I would have never have ever imagined. Oh, my Dolina Boo Boo. See, that's what I love. I love the fact that we have a place here where we can come and like, chill, unwind, forget about our anxieties, forget about our worries, and just like have fun, genuine, genuine, genuine conversation, you know? Adolina, that's beautiful, my love. Yes, ma'au, ma'au. The first time I heard it, I was blown away. Every time I hear it, I'm blown away. Hi, Justina, welcome back. I really got to get started on this mukbang, but I'm so like, I'm lazy. <laughs> I don't feel like cooking. What do you want me to put on your meat? I can make it. Mom, don't say it out loud. <laughs> it's supposed to be a surprise. I'm sorry. I don't mean to shush you, Mom. That was rude. But I know if I wouldn't have done that, you would have continued. <laughs> don't say it out loud. Hold on. Let me mute it. Hold on, you guys. Already, already, I'm back. I'm back or whatever. I'm back or whatever. You guys, I don't want to do my eyebrows. I don't want to do nothing. I just 
Can I just do a mukbang like this? Hi. No. I'm here. <laughs> I did a shimmy and I'm here. Deal with it. I don't feel like catfishing nobody. I'm tired of catfishing. <laughs> I'm tired of catfishing with these eyebrows. Y'all going to see the real me. Who? To the two. <laughs> you encourage us to have fun and know we aren't alone. Anxiety is a B, but we can beat it together. You are a great confidence builder. Oh, thank you, my queen Gigi. Yes, I'm glad you guys can take that away from this channel. You know what I mean? I love it. I wish I would have had this when I was younger. Because now I, I know how to like, well, there are days that I don't know how to control my anxiety. Let me just put that out there. But there are a lot of tips and tricks that I do now. Like, um, what is that called? God, I can't think. When you like, me mechan not mechanisms, uh, techniques. What is it called? Um, when you try to soothe it yourself with like the breathing and uh, the walking and meditate. No, not meditate. It's uh, coping skills. Coping skills. Yes. Thank you, Lindy. Coping skills. So, um, yes, now I know a lot of coping skills to help me. Some days those don't work when it's a severe one, but um, I wish I would have had this back in the day. You know what I mean? When I was younger. I remember being 15, 16, 17, 18, all throughout those teen years, feeling so helpless and hopeless. Like, it was horrible, you guys. I would call the paramedics like a couple times a week, and it was to the point where they're like, they were, careful mama. Did you burn yourself? No. Want me to get the mop? No, I got it. Are you sure? Yeah. What was that? Was that your cheesy? Oh, look, look mama is licking it up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my poor mama. She was heating her up some, uh, some nacho cheese in the microwave and she grabbed the bowl and it was hot and she dropped it. Oh. And there's nacho cheese all over the floor. Mom, are you sure you don't want me to help? Mom, look, it's under the counter. Where? Under there, right? Or am I seeing things? No. You guys, hold on. No, I see something. Yes, mira que no, it's all splattered under there. Oh, under here? Yeah, here, I'll get it. Oh, I got it. Mom, I got let me it. help you. No, that's fine. Oh my God, you're so, in you're so independent, lady. She never wants me to help her with anything. Yeah, she's okay. It's <laughs> literally splattered oh, all the over the kitchen. Yeah, the... Just my kitchen. Aw, mama. She don't. She refuses for me to help her. I have had a panic attack and have used your channel as cognitive help. So God bless you, Chuleria. Aw, thank you, mi amor. I'm so happy. I'm so happy you guys can take that away from, from my channel, you know, and... Like I said, when I first started this channel, I never knew, never in a million years did I expect my channel to be what it is. And what I mean by that is like a place where people can like take away, uh, you know, some positive. How do I say, what am I trying to say? Like, you know, when they're having a bad day and something cheers them up. I'm glad that my videos can do that for some people. I never thought that that would, that would be happening. Meditating. I tried meditating once. It makes my anxiety worse because I get in my own head and I start thinking, overthinking. Oh, Mama, I'm glad you are okay. Yeah, thank you, Ma'o. Yeah, she's fine. Are you sure you're not taking mustis? But it didn't fall on me. Oh, good. Oh, your nacho cheese is so freaking hot. Good thing you didn't get... And you're wearing flip-flops. I told you where you covered slippers in the kitchen. Nate, I know the feeling, well, not to your level, but it is crazy. 
on um what do you mean kind of like anxiety or or do you mean like like a place where where people feel like your positivity i I don't know sorry, I got a little distracted making sure my mom was okay positive reinforcement yes, Nate, because of your channel, I am able kind of come out of my shell laughing out loud. You make me feel so comfortable. Wow, that is beautiful. That is beautiful. I want all of you guys who have dealt with like self-esteem issues and all that, like you have to think about one thing and this is what, what really helped me accept myself and, and change because I'm not lying to you guys, I hated who I was. I hated being fat. I hated being you know, everything about me I hated. And I was I was in counseling for a long time. And I don't know where that self-hate came from. But the one thing that helped me accept myself was we have one life. We don't get a second chance. Love and embrace yourself now. So you don't have any regrets later. Like I always said, I don't want to be on my deathbed. Obviously, I never we never know how we're going to die. But I'm just saying in general, I don't want to be on my deathbed saying I should have, could have, would have. So at this point, whether I make a fool out of myself, I'm an embarrassment, I embarrass myself or whatever. I do what I do for me and I do it for fun and I do it. To express myself, whether people laugh at me or people laugh with me, I stopped caring. I do not care what people have to say about me anymore because my life is never promised. Life is too short. I have family members who are on dialysis, who are who have passed away, and they never got to live their life the way they wanted to. And that I said that. I'll be damned if I'm going to let that be my outcome. So whether you see me jiggle, 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 this wiggle, 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 then that's what you're going to see. And I'm not going to be embarrassed about it at all. And neither should you. I guess the whole point of that message that I'm trying to say is live in the now, be happy, do what makes you happy. Who cares? Don't let what other people's opinions hinder you doing what you want to do. Don't let that hinder you being happy because other people's negativity is going to hinder your happiness. Don't let it. Don't let it. My head runs in circles and over think way too. It's, I feel you, honey. That so would be me two years next month. Aww. My blood pressure go crazy. It's not good. Hi, my Dolina. I just, it just hit me today. I did my best to be strong and I couldn't help but cry. I lost a family member last weekend and today was his funeral. He was only 20. Oh, Mrs. B, I'm so sorry you have to experience that, my love. I send my condolences and my sympathy to you. It's, it's tough to, to deal with losing someone, you know, especially a family member. A real honest live chat and I love it. Oh, just say hi, my love. But I am glad that I have met everyone in here on your channel. Came into my life because the things happen, I just get on your channel. When things happen, I just get on your channel. Thank you, Idolina. I'm sorry for your loss, Mrs. B. My prayers are you. Yes. What's up, Mexican vegan? Bro, I missed you. I'm like, I missed all of you guys. I feel like I haven't seen you guys in forever. Some of you. But it's so fortunate that would, that what you wish you had to help you cope is totally a nightmare for others. Yeah. Internet to hurt and bully, torture others. Yes. Believe me, there are some people that say the most ugliest things in my comments. I delete them. Just because I don't want my family to hurt. I don't want my family to see those comments and hurt for me. I don't care. They don't hurt me, those comments. But if my mom's reading the comments or my nieces, I have the kids in my family, they watch my videos, they read the comments. I don't want it to, to hurt them. 
So I delete those comments, but people say the most horrible, ugly things to me ever. But I don't care. They don't know me, you know? It doesn't affect me. They don't pay my bills. They don't feed me. So it doesn't affect me one bit. You know what I mean? Like, their negative, their hate doesn't bother me at all. I would like to point out something. The reason why everyone is attracted to your personality is because you're somebody who appears to be very transparent. Awesome stuff. Thank you, Eric. Thank you, Eric. I try to be as real and raw as possible. Like, you guys have seen my drunken lives. I don't, you know, I, whether I am happy, upset, sad, in tears, uh, you know, cursing or whatever, like, you guys have seen it all. So I don't hide nothing from no one. I am who I am. I make mistakes. I apologize and try to move forward from them. And I'm only human. And I, I represent who I am to the fullest. Take it or leave it. You know what I mean? That's people I'm people are gonna love me and some people are gonna hate me. I just you know, I I, I don't I don't wanna deal with the with the hate. I don't have time for that. I'm here for the people that truly love me and support me and and are positive. Because I have dealt with so much abuse in my life, like growing up and I'm I'm done. I'm done being someone's punching bag. Mm, my dad, verbally, yes, he did. Oh, yeah. yeah. Never, never, never physically. I was never physically abused, but uh, verbally, yes. I'm, I'm done dealing with people's verbal abuse. And when that ended, it's done. Like there is nothing that anyone can say to me that I haven't already heard, and that is going to affect me. Nothing, no verbal, no calling me a, a fat names or, or talking about my sexuality. Nothing is going to affect me anymore. I've heard it all. And from the very person that I love the most. So, sorry. If you come on, 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 on this platform to try to, with the intentions to hurt me verbally, it's not going to work. I'm a child youth counselor up here in Canada. How you present yourself is what you try to instill in the people I work with. Kudos to you, young man. Thank you, Leanne. Thank you so much. And thank you for what you do because the youth, the children really need you. I, I still remember my youth counselor after my dad passed away. I remember her name till this day. Her name was Nancy. And that, like that lady, she helped me so much. I think I, I wouldn't be where I'm at today accepting myself and loving myself if it wasn't for that counselor. So you guys make such a big difference and such a big help to us, uh, the children. So thank you, Leanne. Thank you, Nate. Thank you, everyone. I'm still in shock about Mr. B is keeping positive. You know what? Mr. B is your rock. And I'm so proud that Luis, you know, is, is, is going to hold you through this. He's a good man. Yeah, thank you, Sandy. Kicking it with Cheryl. Thank you, it hurts. After two years, still can't get the strength to try again. Ay, mi idolina, mi corazón. Damn, Nate, you got me emo now. I hate it. Oh, Kenna. Oh, Kenna, I'm sorry, bro. Love you, blessings. Thank you, Denise. You guys, I know I'm very behind in the comments because I'm stopping them with my finger and I'm like trying to catch up. I, I don't, when I talk about topics like this, I try not to miss anyone's comments because I don't want anyone to feel left out. <gasps> I'm going to tell that to eat a Kleenex box. <laughs> Hi, Howard. I'm here for the beat. Yes, thank you, Howard. I hate getting emo. I'm sorry, you guys. I, I don't mean to get like emotional topics with you guys, but this is a real me. This is, this is who I am, you know? I suffer from anxiety and panic attacks almost daily. Especially since I've been out of work and since I found your channel, you have helped me laugh, smile, and never felt so loved and accepted. Oh, my Jessica. Jessica, boo-boo, you know we love you, my love. All of you guys are loved. I don't ever want anyone to feel like they're inferior to anyone else. 
especially in my channel. Like, we are all equal here. We are all important. Perdón, no entiendo mucho el inglés, pero mi, miro que estás muy triste. Te pido disculpas por no entenderte. Hola, Yesenia ta, uh, Taviria, ta, Tavira. Hola, Yesenia. No, eh, estoy poco triste. Es que estamos hablando de un... Um, como de, de pánico, ataques de pánico o ansiedad. Y mucha gente sufre de esa, de esa um, enfermedad. Um, incluso yo también. So, nomás estamos hablando, uh, les, les estoy diciendo a, a, a la gente que, que se, se amen a uno mismo y que aquí en mis videos y en mis lives tienen una persona y un grupo de, de gente que les da apoyo y que vamos a estar aquí unidos uno al otro para, para darnos a cada uno um, palabras de, de apoyo y, y amor, y amor. So, disculpe que, que nomás hablo en inglés aquí y no hablo en español, pero de vez en cuando si me, si, si me escriben en español, les voy a contestar en español. Okay, so everyone who uh, speaks English and doesn't understand that, I was just, oh, thank you. Thank you, darling. That is so sweet of you. Thank you so much. So uh, I was just, someone asked, uh, they just said um, that they don't understand a lot of English, but they notice on my facial expressions that I'm very sad and they wanna apologize for whatever has hurt me or for what I'm feeling. So I just kind of explained that we're not, I'm not really upset. I'm just stating that um, we're, we're having a discussion about anxiety, anxiety and panic disorder and that we're all here to support each other on my channel and give each other, you know, words of encouragement when it's needed. So, um, yeah, that's what I said in Spanish. Melinda B is going to bed? Oh, no, not my landers. Da oh, hold on, Darlin wrote a message. Darlin, I need to run, boo. Keep doing you, love you always. Oh, thank you. Thank you, my darling pearls. Marvelous. Have a good night. Thank you so much for joining us and thank you for, for your super chat. That is so sweet of you. The pain hurts me every day. I have gained a ton of weight. It's something that you don't know what to do with yourself and your emotions. Amen. I, I feel you, Cheryl. That's me. But you know what? The first key to any sort of change in your life is accepting yourself for who you are now so you can change that later. Like... I hope that makes sense. I, I, I don't want it to be contradictory. What I'm trying to say is love yourself, every bit of yourself, inside and outside. And only then is when you're like, hey, you know what? I love myself, but I want to make changes to love myself more. You know what I mean? It's easier said than done. Let me tell you, I'm no one to be preaching about weight loss or anything because, <laughs> honey, I've been trying it for years and... I'm successful at it, and then I f and then I fail. So, Nate Howard's my main, my true supporter, my straight up. So I know he truly supports you, Nate. Much love as always. Exactly, Sandy. Howard is a good man. Aw, oh, thank you for being you. Love you and you're real, Nikki. Aw, thank you, Dinosaur Justina. <laughs> Dude, everybody makes fun of me of that dinosaur video. I'm like, I wanted to make content for everyone. I, all my videos can't be lit, litty lit, you know, for adults only, you know. I try to make a video for everyone. Even the kids, even the children. Pictures of pictures and models of their feet and hands and their blankets and hats and diapers. Oh, oh, molds. Molds. My poor Edolina. I don't even, I can't relate on what you're going through. I, but I'm so sorry you went through that, my love. And you're still going through it. You know, I'm sorry. I am very emotional on the inside, but try not to show it. And sometimes I get tired pretending and that everything is okay. 
you know what, uh, Annalyn, it's good every now and then to, I don't know how to say it in English, desahogarte. In Spanish, it's desahogarte. Which, how do you say that in English, mom? How do you, how do you translate that? Like, release. Like, sometimes, oh, like, release your pent-up emotion, like, <gasps> and then that, like, <sighs> like, sigh of relief. Sometimes you need that. Uh, can you mute it, Ma? I was bullied in the 7th and 8th grade, and that summer before my freshman year, my dad taught me how to defend myself, just say after nobody bothered and said nothing to <laughs> Yeah, get it, Mrs. B. I suffer from anxiety. It's why I began to watch mukbangs. I found that they would relax me a whole lot, and I'm glad to have found your channel. You are very humble. Aw, thank you, Linda Rosas. Thank you so much. You guys really, when you guys say that, that really makes my day. I bore the hell out of the troll, so I'm not worried, Jessica. <laughs> Canna. <laughs> makes total sense to me. Gotta love yourself first, yep. My go-to video of yours when I'm blue and anxious is the Grim Reaper challenge. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I was ready to expose Diane. She pissed me off when I seen her. She spit out the whole pepper. I'm like, what the heck? How many mods do you have? Just asking because I caught myself in your lives like a lot. Um, I used to have a lot more, but I kind of like just uh, started to filter out the mods that are actually like doing something. You know what I mean? That actually like um remove comments and stuff so i don't know i probably have maybe 15 left if that 10 10 or 15 no about 10 i think 10 so yeah i have about 10 10 mods uh and the reason why i do i have so many as well is because i have different time zones so sometimes i go live during the day when other mods are, it's nighttime and they're sleeping. So those mods on the same time zone as me come in and, and you know, they're helping me with the channel. Or when I go on live at night, there are some mods that sleep, you know, it's nighttime during their time. So the other mods help me at night. So, yeah. Um, RDR made me his mod and I didn't even know about it. And so I commented on one of his lives and spoke, and I felt so honored, just know, know me in some way, just saying her. Oh, that's sweet, Sandy. That's good. It always feels good, you know? Oh, okay, muchas gracias, Dio. Desde que te miré en tus videos, me alegraste mis días porque eres único. Y yo era una persona callada y si es... Cierto lo que dices. Uh, me da mucho gusto, y Yesenia, que, que, que estás disfrutando mis videos y que te pongan alegre. Me da mucho, mucho orgullo, orgullo de eso. So, muchas gracias, muchas gracias. Un besito y un saludote hasta donde estés. The autism awareness video with colorful pancakes was beautiful. You used your platform for good. That's what we love about you. Thank you, Lindy B. Um, yeah, I was going to say something about the negative comments, but you know what? I don't want to give light to any negativity. So, yes, that video was so positive, and I received so much good feedback. I love it. I love it so much. And I'm so glad that, that I was able to highlight that issue. Not issue, but that, um, that uh, illness and... Um, make someone feel special there's someone in in the comments who goes by jay dunn james dunn and he has autism and he was so excited that i made that video so that right there touched me there are other people that have autism that also wrote so that really touched my heart okay girl i will pray for you i understand i do the same thing people just don't understand we'll judge you know what understand the pain. Cheryl, you are such a great person. You're a great woman. And don't let, 
don't let um, negativity. negativity, sorry, I know I was reading a comment that popped up. <laughs> don't let negativity change who you are. You are such a positive person. I swear, literally, like, you do for me what people say I do for them. And when I go on your videos and I'm like having a crappy day, the fact that you're so, you're so bubbly, you're like, yeah, baby, yeah, yeah, yeah. That right there, I just start laughing and smiling. And I'm just like, you put me in such a good mood. Don't let the hate change who you are. Never. I need to start removing mods as well. Starting with Lindy. Oh, hold on. Why is my can my can my canna? Why is my boy Canna not a mod? Hold on. Canna Canna's a good friend of mine, so. Um welcome to the blue team, Canna. Diane tried to do uh pretend she was <laughs> she tried to pull a fast one. You remind me of my ex. The happy and out there you are. Always be happy, love it. Oh, thank you, Hope. I did bark kind of quick, didn't I? Thank you, Lenny. <laughs> Y'all are funny. Plazo te cuer. What does that mean? Saludos, Sousa. Uh, Toa Satan was freaking hilarious. Oh my God, the Toa Satan, that is pain. That is pain, you guys. True pain. Doesn't really touch my heart. Aw, oh, thank you guys. I'm still trying to catch up. I know. Blauzau te quiere. Um, I agree with the autism, autism video was lit. Hey, big guy, how are you doing? Hey, Batman, I'm good, how are you? Long time no see. Uh, gracias, muchas gracias. Te mando un fuerte abrazo. Saludos desde Los Angeles, California. Oh, Yesenia, estás en mi favorito um, ciudad. Me encanta, me encanta Los Ángeles porque a, a mí se me hace que Los Ángeles tiene comida más como auténtica mexicana. No, no sé de qué um, cultura eres, mexicana, salvadoreña, hondureña. No sé qué eres, pero, pero yo sé que en California hay comida mexicana auténtica, pero sabrosísima. Y de otras. Oh, y también de otras culturas. Muy buena. Pero, pero yo digo más eh, mexicano porque es la comida que como más frecuentemente. Pero te encantan las Ay, las pupusas, pupusas salvadoreñas, cállate, mátame con las pupusas. <laughs> have you touched, you have touched all of our lives, Nate. You are a blessing truly. Thank you, my love. <laughs> Cheryl, I love what she looked, she wrote. She said, thank you, Nate. Oh, yeah, baby, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cheryl, you need to do that in all of your videos. I love it. Don't ever change that. Sing? Oh, I don't, I'm not in the mood to sing. I have a horrible raspiness right now. Yes, now I can time out Lindy. <laughs> Actually, a mod cannot time out another mod, so you're stuck there. <laughs> Where's Canners? <laughs> Hi, my Wanda Woo. How are you, sweetie pie? I am loving your guys' videos. Welcome, Kenna. Now we have a new sniper. Just know that I'm the head of security and head of flirting. <laughs> yes, Nate, please sing for us. Oh my God. No. Sing to music. Blue as out. I, I can't play copyrighted music on my lives. I'm sorry, you guys. Oh my God, I'm so behind. I'm like, Oh, Adelina, what's your Instagram? Hold on. I have an autistic son. People need so much awareness when it comes to autism. I always hear the most ignorant comments. That's pitiful. How are you? How is somebody going to talk about children, or you know, even adults with autism? That's that's stupid. How dare they? I, and, and of course, some of them are just ignorance. So.
So, so I understand that, but edu key, education is key. I was going to punch somebody in the crowd last night at the DMX concert. Dude stepped on my girl's... <laughs> no, Persian. Not, not the Ugg boots. What the heck? But hopefully it wasn't intentional. The worst thing you can tell an autism parent is, well, they don't look like... Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? That's horrible. Autism has, doesn't have a face. What the hell is wrong with people? Yo soy de Michoacán, México, así es. Aquí es bien rica la comida deliciosa. Oh, me encanta. Mucho, um, mucha comida auténtica. Saludos, saludos. Girl, help me back. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was a concert purge. Calm down. He probably didn't mean it intentionally. Uh, he should have at least apologized, though. Because she kept holding me back. <laughs> Autistic children slash adults are misjudged and misunderstood. I agree. I agree. 100%. Hey, Persian, would not eat? Uh, yeah, I've used it before, and I don't think he has a problem with it. What up? Hey, Frank, what's up, bro? Come on, let's go, mama. My bro's in here or whatever. Go, I hear that so much, Lindy. I'm like, bad. Oh, the, uh, bad autism is in a physical condition. I know. Oh, thank you, Maria Soto. I'm so glad, Mrs. B, I'm going. Oh, I'm good. Oh, sorry. I'm going to pass away from cancer. Oh, my God, my Tina. I'm so sorry for your loss, babe. The last of dying breed, Nate. The last of a dying breed, Nate. I never thought I would relate to someone on YouTube. You're badass. Oh, thank you, bro. Thank you so much. That's my homie right there. That's my true homie. I hope you and your brother are doing good, bro. I couldn't tell, bro. His friends were talking and they realized I was ready to fight security. Got in the middle of it. Dang, that bad? Prove, prove arroz y. Frijao, Canada. Mmm. Had her accident. She was just seven. I got more looks and whispers from adults. Than she wow, that's ugly. That is so horrible that people do that, especially adults. That's ugly. That really, that really, that grosses me out that adults would do that to a child. Oh. Ooh, please don't get me started on this. Cause let's just oh I need to I need to be positive because that can my nephew is you know um autistic and people not not only is he autistic but he has other issues, you know, and he's nonverbal. He's nonverbal, so he uses sign language and um and he makes noises sometimes when he t he speaks. So it really upsets me when people like look and they start laughing like adults. I've seen it. It's ugly. It's ugly. I feel like turning around and like saying something so nasty, but I'm just like, you know what? God has the ultimate final say. God is the ultimate karma. I don't inv I don't get myself involved in that. Let karma take its place. Bleh. Or run its course, however you say it. Lindy, please stand up. Thank you for saying this. What did Lindy say? Hold on. Even if a disability is physical, people don't need to be ignorant. Oh, I totally agree. I totally agree. Absolutely. Exactly. My little sister has a very large tumor on her chin. It has grown over the years. She has no bottom lip. I have been in more scraps than, oh damn, than I can count over people hurting her. Damn, get it, get it, Tina. Yeah, uh-huh. 
Yeah, you defend your little sis. Get it, girl. Yes. Hola, bro. Hey, Saudi. What's up, brother? I have to agree, Nate. Some adults can be very ugly about literally anything. It, it's beyond me, Nate. Hate it. I know, Sandy. My goddaughter turned 18 today. She is autistic. I love her. She is such an amazing, young, and talented young lady. Oh, Yeah, my nephew just recently turned 14. He is, he's a doll. Me and my brother are doing good now. Thanks for asking. Hope you had a good Easter and a good Friday. Yes, bro. Thank you. I hope you guys enjoyed your Easter too. Tina, I'm sorry to hear people just need to get the their shit together. Honestly. Yeah, I totally agree. My nephew's a high functioning autis autistic. My daughter was hit by a car backing up and accelerated instead of... Oh, no. Oh, me, the worst day of my life. Oh, my God, I can't even imagine that. Oh, that feeling of hopeless helplessness. I need Nate to sing to change this tone of this live. <laughs> uh, defending family is a must. Okay, yes, you guys, you know, it's it's kind of getting a little sad in here for, for some people, so... Let's uh let's get positive. I'm gonna be getting off soon because I have to I have to film uh my collab. But um I guess I'm gonna leave you guys with a song. <laughs> no, no, I'm not. I'm just kidding. I'm going through the same thing. I lost my cousin this past week. My poor my poor boo boo. <clears throat> yeah, always control your temper in front of the kids because then their kids are very observant, dude. Very observant. I remember when my, my little niece was like two years old, I would always pick her up and like, you know, we'd go shopping with her mom, you know, my, my uh, nephew's wife. And I would be on talk. I know this is not a good thing, but I would be talking sometimes on my cell phone while I'm driving. So one day she took a video. I'm on my cell phone as I'm driving and I'm talking. It's not illegal here in Arizona, by the way, yet. Um, so she took a video of her daughter in the backseat. She had a dollar bill because I had gave her a dollar. She had the dollar bill to her to her ear and she was pretending to drive and she was going, yummy, 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 yummy. Basically, the whole point of that is kids are very observant and they pick up everything we do. So if you guys can relax your temper, like, that is probably the best thing to do in front of the kids. Because they, they pick up everything. Aw, uh, today brought memories of our Thursdays on if you have an issue, grab a tissue days. I know. For those of you that don't that weren't subscribed to me then, back when I only had under a thousand subscribers or less, um, I used to every Thursday I used to host a live, and we called it. Uh, well, Casey had named it for me. It was "Have an Issue, Grab a Tissue Thursdays," and every Thursday we'd come on and we would be a support group for each other. We would talk about each other's issues. Um, illnesses that we had and this was just a place where people who seeked support and encouragement this is the this was the place to come to and we haven't had a grab an issue grab have an issue grab a tissue in months so yes you're right baby casey tonight was very reminiscent of our have an issue grab a tissue thursday support groups so this was lovely i really enjoyed your guys's company It was a nice support group. It was. And I like I like the, the rate of these comments. Like, they're not going super fast. So I feel like I'm able to keep up with you guys. On a brighter note, my son is now in high school in regular classes and gets straight A's. I have an IEP uh, Tuesdays and gave him his papers and said he's doing That's wonderful. This support group slash family has grown and still growing. Yes, my Lindy. Thank you, Nate, for sure. That's great, Lupita. It's all because you're a great mama. Yup. Yeah. 
Yes, Tina. He even brought his girlfriend. Oh, oh my God, Lupita. I remember you told me about that. How cool. Oh my God. You're like, oh Lord, here we go. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. New music, Ed Sheeran. Oh, Ed Sheeran has some new music? I haven't seen it. You guys, it feels so good to be live with you guys. Like, it's... Uh, I like at nighttime, you know? It feels good. And under these circumstances, you know, we're all so positive. How do I have people saying my name and stuff? Low-key, I am scared. Wait, what happened? What do you mean saying your name? I just wanted to share that with you, Nate. I'm sorry if I upset you. No, 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 no. No, no, that did not upset me. No, 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 no. You guys, I don't want you guys to feel like that. No, 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 no. Not at all. I want you guys to share, um, you know, to share you guys. But uh, sometimes, you know, some, I don't know, the mood kind of gets like a little bit, a little bit sad. I'm, I'm okay with it. I can deal with it. But I know other people like start to feel it you know it's okay though that's what we're all here for encouragement and and love just joined i'm lost hi by the way you are so nice i'm glad i get to see you live hi christy welcome don't know who but i understand portuguese and it's not saying anything just he's just reading the comments no, he wasn't earlier. Uh, if it's the same... Oh, he's trolling? Oh, okay. There's no excuses in this day that age to be cruel and nasty to a child. Exactly. Or an adult with any type of disability. I agree. Thank you, Betty. Nate, so glad you went live. Thank you, Cheryl. I know you've been asking me for a while to go live, but... Like at night, you know, because um, during the day, I know some of you guys get busy and stuff. But I wanted to do that unboxing and, of course, chit chat with you guys for a little bit. So it was only supposed to be a short live and I've been on for an hour and a half or so. So that's cool. That's fine. I love you guys. I've had so many people attack me and I don't even do YouTube. I even have two stalkers. What? That's crazy. I know, Idolina, you should probably do, like, share your poetry and stuff on, on YouTube. I mean, if if you want, that'd be nice. I hate the fact that there are people that are nasty to be nasty. I agree. I completely agree. Poopsie! <laughs> yes, I'm so excited when I saw the notification. Aww. I'm so glad those noodles make you have Canna! I'm so excited about my noodles! Oh my God, you just reminded me again. I'm like a little a little fat kid in a candy store. I'm so excited. I can't wait to try them. And drink out of my Selena cup. Yeah, so that's what I'm going to do. When I eat those, when I make a mukbang eating those noodles, I'm going to have my Selena cup or whatever. <sighs> Yay, my Britney's back. Bueno, te dejo. Se terminó el... Lonche, tengo que entrar a trabajar. Okay, muchas gracias por venir. Good night, Batman. Have a good one. Thank you for joining us. Oh, I need a drag too. Hey, King Lazy, what's up, bro? <clears throat> Sorry, I was trying to be discreet about it. <laughs> Not very discreet, I guess. That's good, Idolina. That is what I always push people to focus on, the love. That's good. Excited for the noodles. That's beautiful. I know, me too. I had fun with your with your snacks, Jessica. Oh, my God. Those Cheetos lasted me like two, three days. I was trying to savor every bite. Say 
send nudes. <laughs> oh, my niece, my niece has an air freshener that sends that. It says send nudes, and then it's a a, a picture of a bowl with noodles. That's so cool. Nate, you ain't fooling us. What? Ha oh, I know, I know. Sorry, guys. <clears throat> my bad if I burned you out. Discreet. <laughs> You're good, bro. Because it's so easy to react to hate. No one really appreciates the love. So I always tell people, focus on the love and happiness. Exactly. I'm here drinking, watching you and your fans comments. Um, thank you. Thank you so much. I don't, I don't really like to use the word um and and this no no offense to you um i don't really use the word fans um because i i see you guys as family to me and i don't know i just feel like fans is i don't i don't, I don't really use that word um but yeah i i refer to you guys as my bga crew my family so yes i will never refer to you guys as my fans never we aren't fans. We, oh, see, baby Casey already. She's on it. She knows. <laughs> I get mad when you're live and I'm at work. I'm like, really? Wait two hours, please. <laughs> All right, all. Love y'all. Keep your heads up. Stay positive. Good night and sweet dreams to y'all. Good night, Courtney. Thank you for joining us. I'm your fan name. Shut up, Purge. <laughs> uh. We are family here, yes. Friends and family here, absolutely. Wow, Lupita. Stalkers are something else. Bah. Family and good vibes, yep. We're all family. Adolina, you holding out on me? I hope I get to read. I know. I want to read her poetry. Somos familia. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, you guys. Well, before it gets too late, it's already, uh, I don't know. I don't know what time. Oh, it shows on here. It's already nine. So um, I got to get rolling with this, uh, with the smug bang. So next time. All right, Bobby White. Thank you. Have a good night. Hey, I made it back with more beer, chips, and nacho cheese with my family. <laughs> Anna, you got the good snacks. Nate's number one fan. Just quit it, Brittany. <laughs> quit it, my love. I don't let the stalkers get to me bad. Someone came in here earlier saying, I know where you live. Good. Come through. <laughs> Later, Nate. Bye, Frank. Cuídate mucho y mi historia es muy fea. Ay, Yesenia. No, no sé cómo decir um, disculpa por si has pasado por tragedias o, o lo que sea. Pero aquí es un lugar donde podemos hablar y conversar con, con uno al otro. Si quieres un día en otro live, si quieres platicar de eso, te doy apoyo y palabras de, de encouragement, no sé cómo se dice en español, pero aquí estamos como una familia unida. Real recognize real is why I F with you name. Oh, thank you, King Lazy. Thank you, bro. Anything for Salinas. Yes. Good night, my Carrie. Oh, my cookie. Dame un beso. Mwah. Besitos a mi cookie. All right, guys. Well, I got to go. Good night. Hope you enjoy your mukbang. Thank you, guys. I got to start cooking. I'm not in the mood to cook, but whatever. <laughs> I'm hungry, though, so I got to cook. <clears throat> so, um, no... Desahogamos con, aquí con respeto y amor. Es muy verdad. Sassy, you don't, oh, Sassy, you don't have any food. Yeah, I have, I have food. <laughs> yeah, I just have to cook it. 
would have lectured you again for smoking. I know, Luis hates it when I smoke. <laughs> All right, you guys, so I'm Domino's brownies, oh yes. Espero algún día contarle, uh, contarle gracias por tu amistad y corazón. Te lo digo. Gracias. All right, you guys. Besitos. I love you guys. I hope you guys have a good night. Stay positive. Accept you guys yourselves. Like I said, love yourself first and then accept yourself because we're never going to be, or we're never going to make anyone 100% happy. We have to worry about making ourselves 100% happy first. Oh. ATL, I'm uh, about to cook a mukbang that I'm posting tomorrow. It's a special collab with a good friend of mine. So stay tuned tomorrow. I'm posting it. I'll post it in the evening like I always do. Maybe around 5, 5 or 6. Ney es el mejor cuando se trata de escuchar sin juzgar. Muchas gracias. All right. Love you guys.